cars, and students. Two things that don't mix on USC's campus. The heavy traffic flow in and around campus greatly increases the risk for students to get hit by cars. I myself was hit right here on the corner of Blossom and Assembly. I was in the crosswalk on Blossom when a car hit me and sped off. We've had more this semester for some reason. USC Police Captain Eric Grabsky says students getting hit in crosswalks isn't new to campus. However, the increased number of accidents happening this semester has raised some eyebrows. We've had quite a bit of concern, and the concern wasn't necessarily about unsafe crosswalks. It's more than just the crosswalk itself. Um, we've done some enhancements on some of our crosswalks that I'll talk about, but it's also about education and making sure folks know about how to be aware of their surroundings when they're crossing the street. But with all of the enhancements USC has made to their crosswalks, some students still don't feel safe. I've almost gotten hit a couple of times trying to get to classes, crosswalks. People kind of slam on brakes or try to turn when people are walking across the road. When people are making turns and stuff, they kind of just go for it and don't really pay attention to pedestrians. Definitely I feel like I'm playing Frogger sometimes, trying to <laughs> not get <laughs> killed as I'm crossing the streets. Grabsky hears all of the concerns from students, but he says the blame isn't all on the drivers. It's, it's taking personal responsibility when you're a pedestrian and entering a crosswalk. In other words, you shouldn't cross against the light. And when it's a red light, you shouldn't cross. If you're on your cell phone texting or talking, uh, you're more likely not to be able to pay attention to what's coming and going. So we urge both drivers to pay attention to the crosswalks, but also pedestrians themselves to take personal responsibility for their safety. Some students agree. I follow the lights, pretty safe system. And so if you follow the the lights, the crosswalk signs. The USC PD and student government are launching a campaign to promote the use of alternate routes through campus so students can avoid high traffic areas. It may be a bit out of the way, but there is a crosswalk that crosses at Wheat Street that actually goes over Assembly Street. There's also a tunnel that goes underneath Assembly Street from the Law Center to the Coliseum. So if, if, if students can use that crosswalk, then that's, you know, it takes a few minutes, and I know we are sometimes in a hurry, but that's the safest way to do things. Jordan Beck, Carolina News.